But this morning, I want to humbly tender my resignation to His Excellency, the President Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta, the President of the Republic of Kenya, and the Commander-in-Chief of the Defense Forces. And I'll just uh, read what I wrote at night to my President. Sir, it gives me great pleasure to have served as the Speaker of Nairobi County Assembly from September 2017, when we finished the elections to date. We have seen tremendous change, but also challenges. With the coming in of the Nairobi Metropolitan Services, I believe Nairobi will transform to a better capital city. So, notwithstanding, for the last few days, we have seen lots of conflict and even life-threatening incidents. I humbly tender my resignation and for continuity of the institution, I appoint my deputy pursuant to the law and the new act, the Honorable Speaker John Kamangu, who is the deputy speaker, to take over as the acting speaker and also the chairperson of the Nairobi County Service Board as the assembly prepares to recruit a new speaker. I also leave the assembly well prepared, and I know we are in court, but the orders were given, and uh, Jacob Gwele was told to step aside. We had Ada Onyango. All of them are in court, and therefore they were told to step aside until the case is over on the 16th of October. And I therefore appoint the acting clerk who has been there, Ms. Pauline Okuku, to continue serving as the acting clerk, but who is also the deputy clerk administration to support the Honorable John Kamangu during this period. So the assembly is in recess, and therefore, it will be back on the 8th of September 2020. And when they come back, due to COVID-19, the plenaries are still on virtual, based on the advisory given by the head of public service. Once again, sir, I want to thank you so much for the opportunity you gave me to serve Nairobians. And I hope to continue serving in your administration in any other capacity in future. God bless you, sir. God bless Nairobi and God bless Kenya.